Whiskey Boy Chizzle. Yo, what is good, YouTube? It's your boy Chizzle. I am back with another crazy video. It says Pop Smoke is alive, bro. And I'm guessing he's saying Pop Smoke is playing the role of Andrew Wiggins. I mean, I could see it. They do look very similar. They have very similar hairstyles. Dark skin. They have very similar facial features. But, um, yeah, y'all like, comment, subscribe, man. This is getting out of hand, bro. Like, one of y'all commented, this is getting out of hand, bro. And there's, like, three other videos, two, three other videos of him that I will be reacting to within the next few days. That's just crazy. But yeah, you y'all y'all are though constituents X, bro. I don't want to talk too much, bro. Let's get into it. So today's video is going to be about Pop Smoke because Andrew Wiggins plays the role of Pop Smoke. You know, as you guys can see, they look just alike. And Pop Smoke faked his death. You know, he's not a real person. Oh. He's just a fictional character that was played by Andrew Wiggins. And Andrew Wiggins is also a fictional character. I don't believe he's a real person either. And as you guys know, I made a video saying Pop Smoke is Fifty Cent's son, Marquise Jackson. So go check out this video if you haven't. I'm going to put a link at the end of the video. But Marquise Jackson is good at basketball too. So I'm not sure if Marquise Jackson plays Andrew Wiggins and Pop Smoke. Or if Andrew Wiggins and Marquise Jackson both play the role of Pop Smoke. Man, if he does, that's a lot. Like, you got to play Pop Smoke. You got to play Andrew Wiggins. And he could just be playing the role of, so, um, of who he actually is. But like... <sighs> Excuse me, like, my thing is, like, why do they do this? Like, if this is true, my question is, why do they do this? Like, why do they have these celebrities just, like, play roles and stuff? Like, is this a part of, like, an evil agenda and stuff? Because, like, my question, like, just, why? Like, why, like, why do y'all get these people to play different roles and stuff? Because there's a lot of people that say Pop Smoke and 50 Cent look like father and son. So maybe Marquis Jackson just plays him when he's with 50 Cent. But either way, Andrew Wiggins plays the role of Pop Smoke. It's way easier to see this one when you look at Pop Smoke and yeah. Andrew Wiggins. So if they both play him, I feel like Andrew Wiggins plays him the majority of the time. You know, because most of these mainstream rappers are played by multiple... That's probably why he sucks, because he's so focused on being Pop Smoke. He can't get better at basketball. That's why he sucks. And that's why he most likely is going to get traded. He is most likely going to get traded. Along with James Wiseman, but I think they should trade Draymond Green instead of James Wiseman because we need a big. They said they're gonna trade him in um for um Pascal C um Siakam bro. Pascal Siakam is trash. We need James Wiseman. We need a big, but that's off topic. Multiple people. Y'all know I'm a Warriors fan. And Andrew Wiggins is definitely the main one because they look just alike right here. Yes, they do. You know they have the same head shape. And the thing that gives it away the most with this one is the jawline because yeah. Andrew Wiggins and Pop Smoke have the exact same jawline. And I think you can see it more right here. Yeah. So right here you can see they have the same exact facial structure. And the noses are pretty much the same. You know, they didn't really do much to Pop Smoke's nose. But he definitely has My a My question is, is like... Ooh. How long has Whatchamacallit has been playing the role of Andrew Wiggins if he is? Because I was about to say, what's the point of making him into a basketball player, but he sucks. But y'all have to remember, Andrew Wiggins was like one of the top prospects in his class back in high school and college, if he did go to college, which I think he did. That's probably why, because um, he was so good at basketball. So they want to make another character so people can come out and watch him. So they can get more money, more popularity, more fame, stuff like that. But now, what's the point of even playing the role of Andrew Wiggins? Like, Andrew Wiggins sucks now. Like, he's... Nobody... Like, like he sucks. Like, he doesn't do nothing. Andrew Wiggins sucks. That's gone. So Andrew Wiggins used to play for the Minnesota Timberwolves. And now he plays for Golden State Warriors. And I noticed that both of these teams have a blue jersey. And it reminded me of Pop Smoke because he always uses the color blue. And Andrew Wiggins is a basketball player in the NBA. So isn't it funny that they use a basketball for these two songs in Pop Smoke's new album? And then there's this article that says Pop Smoke had a passion for basketball. So there's so many coincidences. And it's clear that Pop Smoke is a basketball player. And to top it off, he's even in a movie that's about basketball. 
stuff we want to soup. Come on, back in the locker room. Alright, alright. And here's some more proof that basketball players are playing roles as rappers. Because there's this article that says NBA 2K22 is going to feature a hip hop career option. Yeah, I heard about that too. Like, when I heard about that, it's like, I thought to myself, is 2K in video games a part of this stuff and a part of this agenda? Because you got to think about it. What are video games? Video games are fun and entertaining. I'm saying, and you know, the entertainment industry is very evil and stuff, right? And being a rapper, a basketball player is a part of the entertainment industry. And so I thought to myself, 2K could be a part of this. 2K might know some stuff that we don't know. It's like, that's that. And I heard about that. It's like, for the past few years, 2K has been forcing this basketball role. It's like, 2K18, your player was DJ. He he was a basketball player, you know. It's like it's like Two K always trying to have a my career story somewhat with basketball. I remember like in Two K twenty, I want to say nineteen twenty, your player met Damian Lillard and y'all was making a song together, like stuff like that. All right. On Friday, July twenty third, Two K revealed the next game's career mode. The city will see a whole new bunch of features added. The focus is on the expansive role oh, Speaking of 2K, bro, 2K22, if I get it, just know we grind it. We going up 2K22. I will be playing current gen. Just know we going up this year, bro. I really wanted to go up this year, but 2K was just trash this year. But 2K22, current gen, if it's good, bro, best believe we will be streaming, bro, if I can. Yeah. In mechanics, it's gonna be going which crazy. includes the chance for players to chase a side career to complement their NBA dreams. So they're basically saying that you're going to be able to play the role as a rapper. And then right here it says, one of those side careers players will be able to choose from is a rapper. Basketball and hip-hop go hand in hand, and rappers and ball players love crossing over into each other's worlds. So the fact that in NBA 2K you will be able to play the role as a rapper, even though you're a basketball player, is very telling because most NBA players are playing roles as other rappers, and I made countless videos about it. And now let's look at all the tweets of people who noticed it, so... This person said Pop Smoke is just Andrew Wiggins with a rap deal. Andrew Wiggins is Pop Smoke's long lost cousin, am I wrong? Pop Smoke looks like Andrew Wiggins. Pop Smoke and Andrew Wiggins ain't the same person. So this person literally thinks that they're the same person. I swear Pop Smoke was just Andrew Wiggins the same way that Lil Mama was just Bow Wow. So this person like, knows that. I really just want to know like. Is all of this stuff connected with like some satanic rituals and something to do with the Illuminati? Like, I really just want to like, I just want to dig deep into this stuff, bro. Because like, the fact that they really getting people to wear masks and play different roles is this and that. Like, somebody that you look up to could be n not even existing, bro. Like, huh, imagine looking up Pop Smoke and Pop Smoke may not even exist. That's tough. Bow Wow and Lil Mama are the same person. And he's saying that Pop Smoke and Andrew Wiggins are the same person. Y'all telling me Pop Smoke don't look like the rap version of Andrew Wiggins? The rapper Pop Smoke looks like Andrew Wiggins. Pop Smoke looks like Andrew Wiggins. So there's so many people that saw this. I thought Pop Smoke was Andrew Wiggins. And then this person said, is that Andrew Wiggins or Pop Smoke? And he's talking about this picture right here. Why Andrew Wiggins look like Pop Smoke? Anybody else think Pop Smoke? And they're making that same face too. That you know how Pop Smoke just just be looking like sometimes like he be looking zooted. It's like Andrew Wiggins. Andrew Wiggins looks like Pop Smoke with a haircut. Pop Smoke looks like Andrew Wiggins. So there was a lot more tweets, but that's more than enough. What's and that? I finally found good evidence. Shout out to whoever sent me this on Instagram. But there's a whole page that shows how they get fake legs. So right here, you can clearly see that these are fake legs that they use to get taller. And this person literally just puts on fake legs and they appear taller. So go. That is disgusting. You look like a whole alien, bro. You were a living nightmare. That is that is disturbing. What is that? You see that these are fake legs that they use to get taller 
What is that, bro? That looks like somebody's head inside of some heels. And look, uh, bro, look at, bro. Nah, bro, that's, that is the devil. That is the devil. I just want to take a quick prayer on um, Jesus. I just want to say, Jesus, um, I preach pray that there's no demons within my house. I'm home by myself. And, um, yeah, I preach pray that uh, you protect me. Keep me safe. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. And this person literally just puts on fake legs and they appear taller. So go check out this page if you want. I'm going to post it on my Instagram too. So, so if that's the case, bro, it's like... They probably won't be... Get, like, if they go in the pool, they're getting exposed. If they go into the pool, they are going to get exposed. And it's obviously going to be like... Fake leg, like they're good. They're gonna obviously know that those legs are fake. If they take off their shoes, their socks, they're getting exposed. Um, if they wear shorts, they may not get exposed. I mean, by you, I feel like the legs do look mm, okay if you like put on the right makeup and stuff with the right um skin tone. It might look real because you know technology and other stuff like that. They can make anything look real nowadays. But with this thing poking out, that's that's one hundred percent exposed, bro. But this is basically what they're doing. They're just putting on these fake legs and fake arms, and they're playing in the NBA. And a good example of this is Giannis because he looks extremely big, and I feel like his arms are so fake. I was looking at his arms the other day, and they look so fake to me. And same thing for Kevin Durant. So just question everything you know. Oh yeah, um, he already said that Offset plays Kevin Durant. He already says Kevin Durant, what you call it, like, is a fake person. And I always noticed that about KD's arms. Like, you know how no offense to short people, because like I'm short myself to be honest with you. But like you, you know, like you know how like short people arm is like kind of like curl up and stuff, and like it just looks kind of like big at certain spots but you know how like tall skinny people their arms are just like skinny and just all the way long and stuff katie's arms it's like to a certain extent it just looks like a short person's arm but just longer so like i kind of see that and i think about Giannis. i had a thought about Giannis in my head one day after he won the finals and stuff like that something about Giannis was like fishy to me Something about him was fishy to me. If they're showing us this, imagine what they have access to. Because they only show us a certain amount. You know, they're not actually showing us the technology that they have. Because <laughs> the technology that they're using to be these NBA players is way better than this. But this is basically just to give you an idea of how they do it. Bro, and like, the thing is, bro, it's like... I forgot, I forgot what I was about to say, bro. I forgot what I was about to say. Alright, so now let's get to the Gematria. So... Wiggins and Pop Smoke both equal 38. And as you guys know, killing, rapper, death, and murder all equal 38. And then Wiggins equals 43, and Pop Smoke equals 34. Just like how murder equals 34, and rapper equals 34, and killing is 43. So as I was doing research for this video, I noticed this article that says NBA star Andrew Wiggins' home was burglarized. And that reminded me of Pop Smoke because they say that Pop Smoke died while his home was getting burglarized. And his home was burglarized in LA. And it's funny that New York Post posted this because Pop Smoke is from New York. But anyways, so his home is in LA and Pop Smoke died in LA because his home was also burglarized in LA. No one that lives there. It's an Airbnb. Airbnb. Yeah. But then yeah, like how do they get the police and stuff? Because like if it's all staged and stuff, like if it's all staged, like, are the police a part of it? If it's all staged? Is anything to do with John Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's, that's what I meant to ask. Like, question, like, is, like, if they have fake, whatchamacallit, fake arms, right? If, like, how do they just, like, move their hands it's like because if i have a fake arm right and it goes out and it's a fake hand the hand 
could be like all the way out here well my real hand so like how do they attach my real hand to the fake hand and make my fit and, and make my hand move and like like how do you shoot like how do you just work it like that like how do you just work that like how do you just act normal and just y'all get on saying like move regular with a fake hand like how do you move regular Last thing I'm gonna show you guys is an interview of Pop Smoke. And the guy who's interviewing him says that he looks like Andrew Wiggins. And notice that Pop Smoke gets very nervous when he brings it up. So thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna show you guys that video. And then I'm gonna show you guys a video of Andrew Wiggins talking. So you guys can see that they have the same mannerisms and a similar voice. Like, like Loki look related, bro. What? Yeah, I could see it. Oh, that and Andrew. Anyone ever tell you look like Andrew Wiggins from the Minnesota Gym Rules? Oh. You've had to have heard that, right? Yo, homie. Yeah, you trying to get me? No, I'm saying. <laughs> Yo, you've heard that. Don't right? start. <laughs> don't Pop Smoke got jokes Greg too. <laughs> don't start. He hey. said Greg Oster. Yo, now that's <laughs> racist. <laughs> Word. Yes. <laughs> you've heard that before, though, right? Never. Never. You're frauds. Oh. Come on, guys. We, we, go, we go Google it, bro. Blood, whatever Google. you want to call it. Stop it. <laughs> Come on, you're a buster. You feel hey, me? <laughs> hey, so um, you got no features on this project? Yeah, they do have some of the voices, but Pop Smoke's voices is just deeper. Like, like your word, ha ha ha, word, ha ha, indeed, ha word, welcome to the sauce, ha ha, indeed, word, ha ha. But who would you like to work with? Uh, uh, 50. Okay. Drake. That'd be mm, big. Jay Z, Meek Mill, Pusha, you know. I think a lot of those are very realistic. I think all of them are realistic, honestly. Yeah, yeah I don't see any be beyond your reach. What's I, your favorite, uh, Hove album? Shit. Which one? Pick one. Mm -hmm. Pick just one. Well, you know, I mean, uh, who? Are you two? two? Yeah. Um, well, getting off the plane, uh, when I got off, I got a chance to come to the Yeah, it's like, he has like more of like a, not like a scratchy voice, but like more of a morning voice. Like Andrew Wiggins have more of a morning voice. You know how like, when you wake up in the morning, it's like, ah. Like kind of like cracky stuff like yeah it's like that you know what i'm saying like andrew wiggins have more of like a cracky morning voice the facility you know and check everything out um and just leading up to the game i was just anxious and excited you know i know the crowd here is crazy the, the energy here is you know amazing you know the culture is amazing so i'm just excited to be part of it it's like andrew wiggins is more of the is more of the proper proper version and pop smoke is more of the word indeed word kaisenat word indeed type person uh for sure you know i met with him earlier and he was just like a lot to get a wider scope of what it will be here obviously you know you see steph and clay over there how do you see yourself? They've kind of talked about you not having to be the star and kind of just being, you know, the school's best thing. Um, yeah, but yeah, man, y'all just comment down below, bro. What do y'all think, bro? Like, if one of y'all comment, this is getting out of hand, bro. Um, Could I believe it? Yes, but at the end of the day, like I always tell y'all, I don't believe it for the simple fact that I don't know this 100%. Yes, he has a lot of evidence. Yes, to a certain extent, I do believe it. You know what I'm saying? But I just don't believe it because, like I said, I'm not Jesus. I don't know everything. I I, I don't know it unless I for real see it and I know it. No, but I don't. I don't know if he really is Andrew Wiggins. But I can believe it. <laughs> but yeah, man, y'all like, comment, subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. If you did watch all this video all the way through, man, go check out my previous videos. One of them should be on the screen right now above me. It's your boy Chisel, kids. People in general, don't do drugs.